Hello everyone, this is Jane Kariuki, Health Now Show, your health friend. I'm so excited to be with you today to talk about another issue, but one that we have been following. You remember last week, the previous episode, we talked with Penina Wamboy and she was talking about relationships and the environment. And if you haven't watched that, kindly go back to the YouTube channel and check on that and check on what she's saying because it's very, very important. Many people say February is a month of love, but on Health Now show, we want to talk about relationships because that may be one day. It may be a, a Valentine's Day, it may be just one day, but there is something that needs to continue. How is that relationship? And that is what we would want to bring to you. And I know that you call your friends to come and watch and comment. Tell us what you think about our journey and what we are talking about. And then I believe that this will have an impact in somebody's life. It will change somebody's life. I've been having many ladies on this show. However, today I'm having a gentleman. When Penina was talking about relationship, she's a lady. And today I have a man who is going to give us a view, a perspective, the way he sees issues of relationships. And, and here we are not talking about relationship between the opposite gender. No, we are talking about general relationships because we have different relationships at different levels. And now we'll sit back, I will allow him to just introduce himself and then we can move on from there. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. Yeah. Uh, I appreciate mom. Yeah. And it's a privilege. Yeah. I count it to be in your show. And uh, one, I want to say you're doing a good job. Asante, asante. You have no idea mm -hmm. until people get an opportunity to testify the impact. I'm also part and parcel of the people that have been impacted in one way my friends through the show and i want to say god is taking you somewhere Asante. continue Asante. so my names are daniel prince or keegan i think many of your friends they know keegan yes. there are places i'm known as daniel mm -hmm. there are places it's prince mm -hmm. but in all i'm grateful i'm a i'm a boy <laughs> these days we have to make it clear and i'm proud to be one so even coming here, <laughs> yeah. I'm coming on a perspective of a, of a man yes. that is proud to be a man. Yeah. And I celebrate that. Thank you so much. So I'm born again. Yes. I love Jesus. Amen. And I'm grateful. I'm just loving Thank because you. of the you have said as a boy. Mm. <laughs> now, we talk about relationships. Mm -hmm. And uh, sometimes we go straight to thinking about a man and a, and a woman. Mm -hmm. But some, but there are so many ways of looking at relationships. Mm -hmm. I would like us to start there. Mm -hmm. How do you look at relationships? Okay, number one, now from the understanding I have now, mm -hmm. I believe the origin mm -hmm. of the idea of relationship mm -hmm. began with God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So the idea of relationship cannot be limited mm -hmm. just between two people. Mm -hmm. In fact, if we were to put everything in order, mm -hmm. then it has to start from God mm -hmm. and come to men mm -hmm. that way. Yes. So for me, relationship is bigger. I think even the misconception of it mm -hmm. is why maybe we have so many damages. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now I believe as we talk, we'll be able to see there are damages in every level. Mm -hmm. The God relationship has damage, mm -hmm. parental has damages, mm -hmm. brotherhood has damages, mm -hmm. even business networks. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There is a lot. Yeah. Because maybe the perspective people have, mm -hmm. the way they relate mm -hmm. uh, with God, the way they relate with parents, mm -hmm. sometimes it's not the way people relate in other networks. Because mm -hmm. I believe one of the greatest things about relationship, the idea of God, it was that it is something sort of generated it has to come mm -hmm. it's like you're passing mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. because this is where the morals the values mm -hmm. the culture the what mm -hmm. so if you didn't have mm -hmm. then what are you passing mm -hmm. 
and i believe if 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 i'm getting it right from the experience mm-hmm. there is nobody you can teach you parental mm-hmm. more than a parent mm-hmm. so you can collect it mm-hmm. with the friends mm-hmm. because they are mothers because they gave birth mm-hmm. now these are things people it's it's a relationship has to follow the process of growth mm-hmm. if it is not grown mm-hmm. you can't arrive there mm-hmm. and if you arrive there mm-hmm. you'll arrive there more either more damage mm-hmm. and even more of a damage to people mm-hmm. that's what is happening mm-hmm. if you see people walking mm-hmm. if people are to be scanned mm-hmm. you see what is happening in the hearts of the people mm-hmm. you realize people are damaged and so when you ask me my perception i will tell you if i am not now god having taken the program and uh work on me work inside me then i would be the wrong person to sit here and give a view because any view i have today someone innocent will get it from a perspective of a man uh, a brother maybe a father maybe a friend maybe a businessman so the view i have even when i was coming i was asking god may my view be genuine there's no need of faking what you know that if someone inherits it's going to bring a damage and that is what is happening because mm-hmm. if i didn't get any moral support behavior support even when i get a son a daughter yes i will do what i know but not what is right and that's where the damage comes in so by the time we are coming to blame us there are people in all respect that maybe the blame should land on but now you see we can't work on blame because number one they did what they did based on what they knew mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. so we will do what we know based on what we know mm-hmm. and i believe that's where the ultimate mm-hmm. relationship being of god mm-hmm. starts mm-hmm. it's in between mm-hmm. and it's the end mm-hmm. if you didn't get it in the beginning mm-hmm. god has a way of rescuing mm-hmm. in between mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. if you don't get it in between mm-hmm. he has a way of making sure that it will not end mm-hmm. in evil yeah. so that's why the ultimate mm-hmm. relationship is the one with god because mm-hmm. maybe some <coughs> didn't get the privilege of others were born the mothers died in hospitals mm-hmm. others their parents died before they were young mm-hmm. so you can't expect this person to have a parental kind of a nature mm-hmm. or mother would mm-hmm. a father would mm-hmm. and maybe these people are not there mm-hmm. so if you they leave early mm-hmm. personally like me mm-hmm. they were there mm-hmm. you know i'm going to share on that mm-hmm. but they were not to the to that apex of responsibility mm-hmm. they didn't take it mm-hmm. maybe as i would expect or as it is ordained of god mm-hmm. so i agree with anybody who was big you are told this is a mom mm-hmm. kikutuma mm-hmm. so some would even send you cigarettes mm-hmm. send you things that at the end of the day we ended up getting into them mm-hmm. because there was there was nobody responsible on what the, someone i can account to mm-hmm. as a baby mm-hmm. and someone a parent mm-hmm. can account to mm-hmm. as god mm-hmm. what are you passing mm-hmm. so these are some of the damages we agree with mm-hmm. and our when i was meditating on this i realized that there are some messes mm-hmm. we have encountered we are encountering mm-hmm. we blame us we blame the people we are encountering mm-hmm. but if it is really checked well mm-hmm. it is a root problem it's not a now problem it's a root problem because like for example you've never grown with a father mm-hmm. and here you are mm-hmm. by mistake mm-hmm. by circumstance you are in a marriage mm-hmm. then anything you will do there is a try and error mm-hmm. it's not from my knowledge because this is what people need to understand mm-hmm. knowledge is powerful mm-hmm. and knowledge applies in all the relationships mm-hmm. if we will talk mm-hmm. and so where there is no knowledge mm-hmm. which leads to understanding mm-hmm. then wisdom cannot be applicable mm-hmm. in the right manner mm-hmm. so people will apply error mm-hmm. then learn from the error mm-hmm. which i believe knowledge is meant to help us evade mm-hmm. what we can know before mm-hmm. so that the time we will waste in healing mm-hmm. in correction mm-hmm. we can use the energy mm-hmm. to pass on mm-hmm. what is right and one thing that i love mm. you say is that uh, relationships grow they they have to 
they have to there is no miracle and they <laughs> there's no miracle there's no miracle in the relationship <laughs> so at the same it's a miracle so it, yeah i know what, mm. what, what you're saying mm. like it has it is a process yeah it is a process yeah. it has to develop mm. yes so now take us to some of the concepts some mm. of the things that uh, you think needs to help that relationship mm. whatever level of a relationship that there is mm. for it to grow mm. i'm just using your own oh, words oh, yeah, yeah. how it can how what you see would help a relationship to grow so that my viewer there mm-hmm. will be saying yes like what I've captured yeah. it is a growth yeah so uh, maybe I will respond to that in diverse way mm-hmm. you know there's one thing that i believe my generation has to get it mm-hmm. that there is no way you can live in this universe mm-hmm. responsibility free mm-hmm. In fact I I always say the worst environment that people can be in mm. is where there is freedom and there is no management mm. of the same freedom. Mm-hmm. So responsibility simply means mm-hmm. there is what is expected of me mm-hmm. as a creature mm-hmm. by the one who created me. Yes. There has to. Mm-hmm. That is a must. You can just be here mm-hmm. and assume that you are just walking on earth mm-hmm. and live the way you want mm-hmm. there is what is expected mm-hmm. i believe either it's vertical mm-hmm. or horizontal mm-hmm. so th- this this one is a must mm-hmm. every human being has what god is expecting mm-hmm. from them yes. so that expectation mm-hmm. is now what uh, helps us to work out mm-hmm. what you are talking about yes. which is now turns out to be the help mm-hmm that helps us to grow. Yes. Like for example, mm-hmm. if we were to say that we just drop seeds mm-hmm. on the soil mm-hmm. and we assume sun, mm-hmm. we assume the rain, mm-hmm. we assume the tilling, mm-hmm. then the seed will grow or the plantation will come up. Mm-hmm. But at a lot of struggle, mm-hmm. weeds are there, mm-hmm. the sun is there, mm-hmm. if the timing is not right, mm-hmm. the rain may not be there. Mm-hmm. So we won't have what we are talking about mm-hmm. growth. Mm-hmm. because growth one of the greatest thing about growth it has it has a procedure yes. it has instruction so when we come into the god mm-hmm. relationship mm-hmm. there is what god has set mm-hmm. it may not be okay with us mm-hmm. but it is, right it is right if it is done mm-hmm. number one human being must mm-hmm. trust in god mm-hmm. that's that's simple mm-hmm. it's simple that way mm-hmm. we don't even need to bargain mm-hmm. we don't even need to convince people mm-hmm. the fact that you are breathing mm-hmm. you are breathing him yes and you can't afford to use the air mm-hmm. without a set instruction mm-hmm. that is helping you to grow like for example mm-hmm. uh, a reality with us mm-hmm. mostly we have the kingdom mm-hmm. is that we don't live by sight mm-hmm. we live mm-hmm. by faith yes. faith is spiritual mm-hmm. so anything in the kingdom of god mm-hmm. has to come in the spirit level mm-hmm. to be able to get him mm. and anything from him mm. has to come in the spirit level mm-hmm. to get to us yeah. so if we are going to grow spiritually mm-hmm. there are things that are set yes. people must read the word mm-hmm. not read it mm-hmm. to preach yes. read it to grow. to grow the same way you are eating yes. you must eat the word that's why it is referred to as a bread mm-hmm. of life yes. you must pray mm-hmm. there has to be a communion mm-hmm. and pray is not just telling god mm-hmm. ah ah this mm-hmm. is a conversation mm-hmm. and continuous mm-hmm. conversation because this is where you get your life mm-hmm. you are sourcing it from here yes. you see now that's one yes now there are other relationship that comes in mm-hmm. we have parents yes. also this is now where the 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 big problem comes in yes. because some parents are not privileged mm-hmm. maybe to know what we know mm-hmm. but there's what they know mm-hmm. and me i believe the greatest gift we can have to them mm-hmm. is not to blame mm-hmm. or maybe to stand and correct we can't mm-hmm. but it is to be positive on any error mm-hmm. we get from them mm-hmm. and see what we can do mm-hmm. by the help of god mm-hmm. that we don't end up mm-hmm. passing the same problem mm-hmm. so i believe what really works mm-hmm. from the small experience that i have mm-hmm. i believe the reflection of kids mm-hmm. or we the children mm-hmm. is proportional to what they was instilled mm-hmm. to us by parent mm-hmm. morals mm-hmm. good morals mm-hmm. is part of the 
that I can call an ingredients mm-hmm. that will help mm-hmm. one to grow mm-hmm. in a family relationship. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Love is ultimate. Mm-hmm. There has to be love in the family. Mm-hmm. It doesn't matter. I believe the most safest place should be family mm-hmm. set up. Mm-hmm. Because I believe that uh, if people love you, munipende mm-hmm. inje. Mm-hmm. If my people don't love me, mm-hmm then i think that's that's where the problem is because mm-hmm. at the end of the day these are the people mm-hmm. you don't need to pray to be theirs mm-hmm. you are theirs yeah, yeah. you end here yes and anything you do anything that happens as you grow mm-hmm. has its own effect mm-hmm. a time is coming in life i'll be old yes reality i don't know why reality is come on people are old mm-hmm. that's when you realize you didn't invest that's mm-hmm. why I, i want to make a statement mm-hmm. oh you see the 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 issue of relationship mm-hmm. the greatest in all the aspects from god parents people mm-hmm. is when people can view relationship mm-hmm. as a lifetime investment because mm-hmm. many people mm-hmm. we live in assumption mm-hmm. and that's why we don't count it privilege mm-hmm. like for example i, I take it as a right mm-hmm. that you are my mom mm-hmm. there are things i will never get from you mm-hmm. Because number one, that atmosphere of getting moral, mm-hmm. I have to understand if it's of mom is official, mm-hmm. she's official. Mm-hmm. If she's at home, mm-hmm. she's mom. Yes. If she's a pastor, she's a woman of God and she's mom. Yes. All those kids have to have a way of balancing that. Mm-hmm. And so when you see it as an investment, mm-hmm. there's a consciousness of profit mm-hmm. and the consciousness of loss. Mm-hmm. Nobody loves loss. Nobody everybody loves profit yes. so if you truly want profit yes. what are you profiting that relationship because it's a reflection mm-hmm. life is so principled mm. in a way that there are things that don't need prayer mm-hmm. you just need to understand the principle mm-hmm. if i honor mom mm-hmm. the, the principle is simple mm-hmm. i'll live long mm-hmm. i don't need to pray for mm-hmm. the length of life mm-hmm. i need to follow the principle mm-hmm. so once i follow the principle mm-hmm. the length of life will follow me in one way or the other. So when we view it as an investment, mm-hmm. you are conscious of not losing the person, mm-hmm. not losing what you are getting from them. Mm-hmm. So you will be conscious of anything that can make you grow in bond, grow in that attachment in a sober way. You can't take advantage of me because even the consciousness cannot allow you Because listen to this mom what is lacking in our time today mm-hmm. is that people are dead in the conscious mm-hmm. as if somebody can wake up and rape mm-hmm. that conscious is not in them if you trace it if these people grew in attachment found attachment found a bond that is in balance there is no unfair regime there is no partiality you found your parents where by you wronged me they will rebuke you right there no this is your elder brother mm-hmm. this is your small brother mm-hmm. that management is what brings a balance in respect in honor in the treatment but you see now when you grow somehow anyhow mm-hmm. anything you pick mm-hmm. and this is one thing people need to know mm-hmm. the enemy is on the run mm-hmm. when it comes to relationship because mm-hmm. i want you to ask yourself mm-hmm. If, if if relationship is not important mm-hmm. why is god so much on relationship mm-hmm. why is he so much on us relating mm-hmm. in fact he doesn't need money mm-hmm. if if people can just know how to relate with god mm-hmm. god is okay with that mm-hmm. it is him mm-hmm. who will look at anything that is needed to strengthen the relationship mm-hmm. if it is money mm-hmm. he will set it there mm-hmm. if it is people mm-hmm. he will set the right people there mm-hmm. but now when that thing is not there mm-hmm. because man is wired to relate man will always look for something that's why people are leaving relationships with men they are relating with dogs relating with cow let me tell you the danger there in in the relationship of man there are things that we've been wired to understand one another i can come and cry mom because i'm having depression there is no day the cat will cry it has a depression you will cry the cat will not even understand why is this fellow crying so you will only cry and lie to yourself that there is someone that is consoling you here but that's a lie because it is not wired that way there is a way animals 
partake when it comes to relationship because this is something people need to know. Mm -hmm. But there's also the way man has been wired. Mm -hmm. There is a way we understand mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that this is a good, healthy relationship. Mm -hmm. And it's good we understand mm -hmm. that it doesn't end with good relationship. Mm -hmm. We need to come back to the core of the show. Mm -hmm. Healthy relationship. Okay. There's a difference. Yeah. It can be good, mm -hmm. but it is sick here. Mm -hmm. You can have a good husband, mm -hmm. but you are having you are sick mm -hmm. in financial management. Mm -hmm. That relationship will knock down because mm -hmm. there is no full health mm -hmm. in the relationship. Mm -hmm. And these are some of the things that we need to understand mm -hmm. that a relationship or relationship from the perspective of God, if you ask him mm -hmm. and if you study the scripture, mm -hmm. when he made you, mm -hmm. there is what he expected. Mm -hmm. So we are like seeds mm -hmm. to him. Mm -hmm. So if he doesn't get anything, mm -hmm. chances are mm -hmm. he won't risk to sow you again mm -hmm. or risk to invest anything in you. And I'm loving the way you are putting it. Eh? Mm. You are saying growth, it is, it, relationship has to grow. Of course. You are saying it is, we look at it as an investment mm -hmm. because when you, and, and then there is the profit and the loss. Yeah. And be aware of both mm -hmm. so that you will not take advantage exactly. of one another. Mm -hmm. I think we can go to the, that concept. Exactly. Yes. Now we touch on now because the we family. Have now come from God. Yeah. Family. Our relationship with Him. Mm -hmm. We come from the family. Mm -hmm. Now take us ahead. Uh, maybe now we can touch a little bit on now the sibling level, because mm -hmm. now this is now where the problem is. Mm -hmm. uh, many times the crisis begins. Because now you see you are a mother. Mm -hmm. I know you can do it more. Yeah. But from an experience, I know mm -hmm. there is a time when we grew, mm -hmm. we, the way our parents handled mm -hmm. a new coming baby mm -hmm. was very funny. Mm -hmm. In fact, what we were left with insecurities and tension. Mm -hmm. But now they would bring a lie, mm -hmm. which I want many parents to know. You can't lie to growth. You can't. You can fake growth, yes. but you can't lie that you are growing. Mm -hmm. And if you lie to growth, mm -hmm. it will reflect at a wrong state in life. So they told us we are going to buy a kid. So I would wonder <laughs> where was I bought. And so when the baby comes in, because, you know, it's good for this one I'm talking because there has to be a good transition preparation. I thought it is as at our age, hey, when me, babies were being born. Me, me, I think I'm the one winding up the analog era. <laughs> I found crazy stuff. <laughs> I had a problem with my brother, by the way. And hey. then these are things I'm telling you, yeah. if we look at them and blame, mm -hmm. we won't learn. Mm -hmm. But these are the messes our parents did mm -hmm. because they only operated by what they knew. Mm -hmm. So they would give babies, maybe even without plan, mm -hmm. So even by the time you are finishing, you know, breastfeeding, mm -hmm. another one is here. Yes. You are even being chased mm -hmm. not to, to do the necessary. <laughs> do so you see that transition yes. uh, healthy-wise in all dimensions, spiritual, mental, psychological, mm -hmm. they have their effect. Mm -hmm. Because I want you to, I want people to sit and imagine mm -hmm. anything that God so good, mm -hmm. what can man mm -hmm think mm -hmm. in his own perspective mm -hmm. and do away. Mm -hmm. If he saw breastfeeding was healthy, mm -hmm. what, what's the benefit? Mm -hmm. If he saw the growth was good. Because mm -hmm. like, for example, if I can touch on the Bible, if you allow me, mm -hmm. the first man never grew. Mm -hmm. That's why we have this mess. Mm -hmm. mess. Mm -hmm. Adam was never a youth. Mm -hmm. He never had a chance of becoming a teenager. So Abraham knew <laughs> nothing. That's why the second Adam <laughs> has to be born. He has to grow. Mm -hmm. The Bible says he grew. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. In wisdom, in yes. suffering, uh -huh. in all that. In love. So if he, God, the second God Adam being God, yes. notice mm -mm, there is an error. Uh -huh. This man, mm -hmm. because listen to this, mm -hmm. corrections are done well. Mm -hmm. Especially parents need to hear this. Yes. The best person to instill moral, mm -hmm. discipline, mm -hmm. correction, mm -hmm. culture, all that stuff, mm -hmm. standards, mm -hmm. uh, you understand? Mm -hmm is parent. Mm -hmm. I'm not here to compare them, mm -hmm. but I wish mothers would understand. Mm -hmm. They have the greatest privilege and the greatest responsibility. There's a connection between a mother and a kid that no matter how old I am, there's a way you can shout at me. Mm -hmm. 
I'd rather go and scream outside, but I can't talk to you. But you can tell me anything at any age. What a pastor can't tell me, you can tell me. And do you know something? If I turn at you there, I provoke a curse. But you can never. You can only provoke a judgment mm -hmm. from God. Mm -hmm. So if parents can use that well, that's where the morals were to be passed. Value, system. This is your brother. Because like, for example, some of us, we don't share the fathers. So this is when the father would come and visit them, go with them, buy things. We just look at them. In the family. Yeah. Me, I can tell you, and I'm saying this as a testimony, mm. not to be crazy. Mm -hmm. I, I think in our family, everybody has their own father, their own tribe. Mm -hmm. So I think we are a nation in one house. That is why you speak all this language. Yeah, that's the exposure that came. Because now I was born in a family. Mm -hmm. I, I have never had an experience with a father. So the one I had was Father God. So Father God doesn't collect what you came with. He has to empty you. And now started instilling fatherhood in me and making me know what is to be a man. What are the responsibilities of a man? In fact, this is one thing I want to talk now to that, that grows these other relationships, men, mm. ladies, adults. Mm. Uh, we need to understand, number one, like the issue so of... So now we, we are at the... At the now the, yeah, the, the we, adults. Eh? Yeah, the adults. Now men this is and women. We men. Uh, we are not even in relationship now, mm -hmm. the lovers. Mm -hmm. Is now the morals of forgiveness. Those are some of the things I've seen. Let me tell you, ma'am, if there is something that can hold a relationship between a man and the mother, a man and the father, is the issue of forgiveness. Number two, there has to be not something you are borrowing when there is a crisis. There has to be a system implanted. That's why I told you it has to grow. That has been implanted of a capacity of understanding. You see tolerance. I ask people, why are parents so tolerant? That a parent can die knowing that the son is a thief, but she will never join the congregation to confirm that. Mm -hmm. So the woman can tolerate until, by God's mercy, the son changes. So if you didn't know the son, you can't attest that the person was a thief. So that tolerance was not supposed to end with women. It was supposed to be passed on. So that, because people need to know, when I'm raising a, a daughter, if I'm raising a daughter as a man, and I'm expecting to be someone's wife, something will be amiss. So the absence of a mother is a crisis that only God can intervene. The absence of a father, because there is no day I can be a mother, even if I do motherhood. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I can't breastfeed. Mm -hmm. That's a reality. Mm -hmm. There are things I can't understand about womanhood, mm -hmm. a manhood. I, I can't be the right person. Mm -hmm. And so when people understand that, it becomes balanced mm -hmm. because if you if you see the word health mm -hmm. it's simply a, 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 an outcome that maybe the doctors do after the you see the test the what mm -hmm. and then now they can give a feedback mm -hmm. that you are well mm -hmm. it's simply they are saying mm -hmm. there is a balance mm -hmm. in the way the systems are functioning in you so that each part of the system mm -hmm. has their own roles yeah and working they're, yeah they're they're working they're, working they're well. interconnected mm -hmm. so that a relationship the health the health the growth so that there'll be growth mm -hmm. the relationship will be healthy yeah there'll be investment yeah there'll be profit exactly there'll be um, a holistic it will be holistic yeah profit wow mm -hmm. tunasonga pole pole so, Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, the now I, be, I believe I believe now ko wapenzi sasa hapo ndio mambo iko and if you look at wapenzi mm -hmm. I think it is the most um shouting maybe if I can say the loudest relationship mm -hmm. uh, in, in based on all yes fuck the word says it's only in this relationship where people live Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They leave parents, they mm -hmm. leave home, mm -hmm. and you come and join a stranger mm -hmm. that maybe you don't understand or know well. Mm -hmm. This is now where the crisis comes in because mm -hmm. the, the expected end of this relationship, to many of us, 
I'm not here to point anybody, but to many of us, we either have a wrong picture, a wrong experience, that's where the picture is coming in, or we have wounds and injuries. And, and listen to this, and people need to know, we have so many sick people. In terms of relationship, we, I think if there was an hospital that deals with the relationship, they would be people, having a crisis people. of room, yeah. Therapists are yeah, there. Exactly. That is the but now, the, but now the problem that is, mm. very few are willing to come to you people. That's why you see depression, suicide. You do a research. I was doing a research. I was shocked that the majority of the people that are committing suicide, the the the, the root cause, when it is it is traced, it is relationship to do with lovers. I believe if I'm not wrong, it's called the Emilio, mm -hmm. not, not the Agape. Mm -hmm. That's, you, you will hardly find someone committing suicide because of God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But people can kill themselves mm -hmm. because of lovers. Mm -hmm. Now, I want you to get something. Mm -hmm. For the parental, mm -hmm. for a child to come to a point of committing suicide, mm -hmm. if you look at the setup of the family, the mother, the frustration maybe is too much. Mm -hmm. There is crisis, there mm -hmm. is war. Mm -hmm in that setup mm -hmm. for this person to feel no i can't take this anymore mm -hmm. there is rejection mm -hmm. there is hate maybe mm -hmm. stepmother stepfather mm -hmm. in that level mm -hmm. but now if this person grows mm -hmm. because i want you to see something mm -hmm. if you promote mistake mm -hmm. it doesn't learn to the next level mm -hmm. the same with the same intensity mm -hmm. it has a bigger intensity mm -hmm. you didn't work it well mm -hmm. with mom mm -hmm. how are you going to work it well mm -hmm. with a husband because, for example, I want you to see this. Mm. We have not grown in humility. Mm -hmm. I've not grown in the qualities of submission. Mm -hmm. I'm never told. Mm -hmm. And here I come, mm -hmm. relationship to do with lovers has all to do with being told mm -hmm. and listening. Yes. And here you have a problem with listening. Mm -hmm. Like now our generation, and this one I'm going to say, mm -hmm. it may land me in trouble, but I'm okay. Mm -hmm. We have a problem with rebuke. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we <laughs> have a problem with rebuke. Yeah. Because we, pass, especially the people who are orphans, mm -hmm. they perceive rebuke as a language of hate. Mm -hmm. But I realize even if I'm an orphan, mm -hmm. I need to understand if what this person is expressing means good, then I have to bring down my right of state and swallow the wisdom, swallow the knowledge. But I can't pull a wall of orphanism so that I'm not told, okay, you are an orphan then life will prove to you that it doesn't respect orphanism. Life is, set, is a set of principle. Mm -hmm. If you can't work, mom, let me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. Does the life know that you are an orphan so it will give you food? Mm -hmm. Principle is simple. You have to do something. Many people on these streets, they are orphan. They are selling. We have orphans who are millionaires. Mm -hmm. How did they arrive there? Mm -hmm. Do you think it was pity no. and sympathy? No. So those are some of the things we have collected. And we are, we are coming and is a blind man meeting a blind man, a sick man meeting a sick man. I think sick people should go to hospital both. <laughs> then after being treated, yes. come as healed. Mm -hmm. So that at least what might affect this relation, because some of the things that are messing, people killing one another, mm. people even committing suicide. Mm. If you trace the problem, mm. you realize it's a problem that can be managed. Mm -hmm. And many times, like we for men, let me speak for men. Mm. Men, men are the most damaged when it comes to identity crisis. Because I want you to see something. The amplification of the woman, the girl child, and women rising to empower, to support, is so high. So men ni kangumu. So in that process of kangumu, a lot is missing the boy child. So the, boy, the boy child is on a crisis as far as transition is concerned. The moment you've grown, umefika class eight, umetairi, a lot is expected of you that even you yourself, you are not ready for. Like for example, Mimi, I almost started becoming like a father in our home. Mm -hmm. When I was in nursery, I would come, natoa manguo, nachukua magnet, spark, then naenda ni kirogota, rogota tumisumari, ni pime, so that I come home with thin two bob. Then mom would do the division, then we eat. 
Sometimes I mean not a school. In fact, I was, there was a time I would go with uh, home clothes. But if you see me in school and after 30 minutes, you can't tell this is done. I'm chained. Niko na civilian. Mi niko kazi. So I grew toughly and I want to, to ask even if, you know, because he even called me Baba. He used to call me Baba. So I wonder. Okay, I'm a Baba based on the Baba. Hey, baba. Because because baba the roles and the, the, roles, the and the early. Because I want you to see something. Anything is good. But there are things that if they come to us before time, they turn out to be poison. Because there is something I need. The structure of growth cannot, you can't bribe growth. You will only be lying to you. No, ma'am, you can't sit here and say, I'm changing. And you know in a private room, you are not changing. Who is lying to who? God is watching. The devil is watching. You are watching. So you lie to us for 10 years, but the fruits of what you are growing will grow. It will be so audible, it will be so public, and at the end, it will torture you. And those are some of the things that are happening. You see now, the ladies, there are some gaps. Like, for example, there was no good relationship with mom, simply because he do, she didn't do this, they didn't do, do that and that. And so you grew with grudges. So when you are coming into this home, it has a mother-in-law. If you are own biological mother, you don't honor. Do you see the chances of honoring a mother-in-law? It must be very different. Because you, you, you will even need to be delivered from that mentality of mother-in-law. Mm -hmm. Now, to a mother in love. Mm -hmm. So that there can be a soft spot, a soft room, mm -hmm. that you don't just see her as a mother to your husband. Mm -hmm. She is now your mother. And these are the damages. Mm -hmm. Like I can tell you right now, mm -hmm. if we are going to, to be honest, where we are headed to. Mm. I'm sorry to say this, I'm not a prophet of doom and I'm not prophesying. Mm. If the Lord does not intervene mm -hmm. and raise people who are going to restore balance mm -hmm. and genuineness, mm -hmm. then the high chances are we will have children in the future. Couples that are gays, lesbian, because I don't blame gay. I don't blame lesbians until I understand the root cause. Because some of them are product of the absentism of this quality. If I'm getting circumcised and the person watching over me is my mom, what does my mom know about that? So mama, you find there are many I know, they sleep. Almost my age, they still sleep in the same room. So the mother can do anything in the same room. So what are you, if this man cries, instead of you as a mother understanding that this is not just a cry that needs a leaning shoulder, it's needed, okay, sober up. After sobering up, now sit here, I tell you the truth. Now the mother will come and bring a leaning shoulder, while else what is needed is a talking shoulder. You need to talk to me, because what is making me cry is not worthy me crying. Because I went, I didn't get a job. So will I cry forever? So, okay, kuna statement on a statement, up on your mama unaingia kwa mjama, but laingia kwa aledi. So already what you have passed on mm -hmm. is a very fragile man. Mm -hmm. So when this man comes in, because listen to this, if I get married, the, the chances of getting an opposite person in behavior is, is high. Mm -hmm. I can't say that I'll get a woman who says yes, yes, mm -hmm. who says everything yes to me. Mm -hmm. There is a woman who will tell you, no, I know the man is yes, but you're not going to invest there. Mm -hmm. So if you are not a man that is structured well, mm -hmm. that can stand and endure that mm -hmm. and see the sense, mm -hmm. you will go back and tell mama, mimi odem, I will me mwacha mimi. Okay, if ikichunguzwa vizuri kwa nini me mwacha, is because he is challenging, she is challenging you, mm -hmm. but the way una interpret, mm -hmm because it's not matching the way your mother pampered you. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I interpret that this person is against me. Mm -hmm. And that's something that needs to be restructured mm -hmm. so that our youth, our young people can be able to know mm -hmm. the languages mm -hmm. in dimensions. Mm -hmm. The way mom can talk to a girl doesn't match mm -hmm. the way daddy can talk to me. You can't expect it. It's just a soft nurses. Mm -hmm. 
na kuwe soft na wena ni bro. If he is raising you that then he is raising two sisters in different genders. Mm -hmm. There has to be somewhere mm -hmm. where the toughness is instilled. Because mm -hmm. mom, mom, mom raised me, I'm talking to the mothers, mm -hmm. raise us with the reality that we are going to face. Mm -hmm. Don't raise us like the word looks like our home. Mm -hmm. Raise me in a way that son, mm -hmm. one day you will leave this door. Mm -hmm. And what you will face mm -hmm. are people that don't care. Mm -hmm. So what do you do in an environment that doesn't care? Yeah. Bring care. Okay. Now, the other thing that I would like us to look at eh, mm -hmm. is uh, you are a business person. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Let us look at relationships at the business level. Mm -hmm. Because we've looked at the other levels. So what would you say mm -hmm. about what aims or makes the relationships at business level, work level, mm. that uh, may need to be looked into or what you have experienced mm. in, 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 in the work workspace. Mm. Yes. Uh, I, I, I will always quote mm -hmm. and say the origin mm -hmm. of relationship is God. Yeah. Now, the best place to, to rectify mm -hmm maybe if you are willing to mm -hmm. the messes of damages that people grow with mm -hmm. the business will train you well because mm -hmm. now in business the mentality or the aspect is what profit are you bringing mm -hmm. there is no brotherhood in fact the company can be of my brother mm -hmm. but now the policies of the company mm -hmm. doesn't address me as a brother mm -hmm. i'm a colleague i'm a worker even if i have a position that setup doesn't accommodate home things. Mm -hmm. So I want you to see if all grows well, and if you can see there are people who have really structured that well, mm -hmm. they grow their kids, mm -hmm. family-wise, mm -hmm. business-wise, what they do. Mm -hmm. By the time they are growing, mm -hmm. they are able to cope up. Because now the setup of business mm -hmm. is very sensitive. Mm -hmm. You're dealing with people that you don't have time maybe to grow into their space so there are qualities you will need to operate in such a setup like number one i tell people self-control is very key when it comes to business and let me let me let me first of all begin by saying god is very key mm -hmm. when it comes to doing business mm -hmm. deal, because in business emotions are so high mm -hmm. you need someone who can manage emotions a client will abuse you someone will not pay you someone will deceive you a deal will go haywire. If you are not emotionally stable, now the health issue comes again. Mm -hmm. There is going to be a very heavy crisis because listen to this, I tell people, mm -hmm. in business, mm -hmm. no matter the crisis, mm -hmm. no matter the pressures of the economy, mm -hmm. you have to be so, so, so safe mm -hmm. with you mm -hmm. that nothing that is happening in the market mm -hmm. can drown you. Mm -hmm. So it simply says, mm -hmm. there is a time you can lose mm -hmm. and, and decide to let go, mm -hmm. not hold. Because mm -hmm. now if you hold, mm -hmm. you are threatening you. But you see that power, mm -hmm. that stamina, that structure, mm -hmm. I, I, like I told you, it does, it's not a miracle. Mm -hmm. This is something that people grow into. Mm -hmm. And especially when they grow in an healthy, balanced way. Mm -hmm. Business is not a joke. Mm -hmm. I think... The, the next example I can compare business mm -hmm. is marriage. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. Marriage is a good zone mm -hmm. to tell you business mm -hmm. because everybody has to be, has to adjust to what we call mm. a real humility. Mm -hmm. Business will tell you are doing wrong. Mm -hmm. And also there is a time you will tell business I will prove you wrong. Mm -hmm. Business will not entertain you that you can wake up at any time and think you will short change system to get a profit mm -hmm. it will give you what you are sowing mm -hmm. so the principle of sowing and reaping mm -hmm. is very key in the business industry so mm -hmm. what happens in business and this one i can say they are part of the things people can notice sicknesses in business mm -hmm. number one there are people who are landing into business from pressure because it's good it's good people to understand everything as a an aspect of calling you may be a doctor to some doctorship is i did a training to some it's a calling so by the time i'm coming to class to study it's because the passion is driving me there 
So I'm going there to be structured. Because no matter how powerful you are, no matter how gifted you are, there is no day they will land you a certificate of doctorship. It is simply because you are passionate. There is a procedure that they have to walk with you as when the journey comes in, as where the growth comes in. So these are some of the sicknesses that I mean. People are getting into things because of pressure. Mm -hmm. Others are getting into business because of love. Mm -hmm. So if people are to get into business, me, I advise men mm -hmm. and young people, mm -hmm. can you find your passion? Because listen to this, ma'am. There comes a time in the history of business where you feel like quitting. But when you remember how you feel when you make people look good like me, You'll hey, you, like you encourage yourself because the passion is pushing you. You, you understand? You yes. This is where you'll see a doctor mm. who will not just administer to a sick person. Mm. Passion will lead the doctor to fast and pray and tell God as I do that surgery. Mm -hmm. I know I'm just a mere man, mm -hmm. but I know if you intervene, mm -hmm. all I will be doing is applying mm -hmm. into the reality what already you have done. So the relationships are again. Again. Because I have heard many times mm -hmm. some doctors mm -hmm. will go out of their way. Exactly. They will follow up exactly. somebody. Mm -hmm. Probably it's, it's an operation, yeah. a surgery like mm -hmm. you've, you've mentioned. Mm -hmm. They want to know how you are doing. They even want to relate mm -hmm. with the family mm -hmm. so that, you know, because of that kind of exactly. support. Mm -hmm. And they, you know, people even make friends mm -hmm. as family yeah. with doctors, Very key with friends. the nurses, mm -hmm. with the professionals mm -hmm. in the health mm -hmm. sector because of the way. Mm -hmm. Because they don't just look at the situation mm -hmm. that I am treating you. Yeah. We've even had mm -hmm. some, some doctors, mm -hmm. they are so into the relationship with their patients mm -hmm. in terms of how they relate. I, I'm not saying in any um, negative way. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And some of them become so concerned about their patient mm -hmm. to a point that some of them have even died mm -hmm. by suicide. Oh my. Because of the love, because they, they yeah, are feeling yeah. like they are not able to give what they ought to mm -hmm, give. As mm -hmm, much as they are giving mm -hmm, the medication, yeah, yeah. they feel that there is something as extra mm -hmm. that I need to do, yeah. but I'm not able to, to do it. Some of them we've heard yeah. in the media mm -hmm. that some of them may have died mm -hmm. because of feeling inadequate oh for that relationship. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now That's I the know attachment. our time is really pushing mm. us. It's really <laughs> pushing us. But I want Thank us God. to look at, uh, we've looked at the business, we've looked at uh, the different levels that we, we've looked at. So what what is one, probably you can share with us, one or two things that people need to watch out. You've mentioned as we go along, we have gone along. What should people watch uh -huh. even when they're saying, I am related to this in this, either professionally, yeah. parental, as a colleague at work, or whatever level of relationship, parental that it is. That, what are some of the things yeah. that you like? You would like to share with us, and you can look at that camera mm -hmm. and, and and tell us what is, what do you think? One can either improve, or what we need to look at, as red flags so uh number one mm -hmm. i want to to make it maybe to submit mm -hmm. to the viewers mm -hmm. uh nobody knows all mm -hmm. when it comes to whenever you hear the term growth mm -hmm. it has to register in your mind there is a procedure mm -hmm. so this is something that people need to understand mm -hmm. and it has to register in our mind mm -hmm. that uh there there are there are two things that God, in his own sovereignty, mm -hmm. established mm -hmm. in the universe. Mm -hmm. Number one mm -hmm. is the principles, the laws that governs the system, mm -hmm. the earth, mm -hmm. and of course the creatures that he made. Mm -hmm. So the earlier we get into that reality mm -hmm. that even God himself mm -hmm. considers growth, mm -hmm. and not just growth, a right mm -hmm. structured growth, mm -hmm then our viewers need to understand this is pastors, mothers, mm -hmm. children, mm -hmm. anybody that will be watching us. Mm -hmm. You can't evade growth. Mm -hmm. You can't bribe the channel mm -hmm. 
that you are supposed to go through to grow. Mm -hmm. And this one leads me to tell people, mm -hmm. there are some process you will go through, mm -hmm. they are painful. Mm -hmm. But the end result, which is now the fruit, mm -hmm. is great. Mm -hmm. you, you, will, you will never regret mm -hmm. what you would have regretted mm -hmm. if they didn't take you through the process. So I will also encourage mostly, because I know relationships, they are of many level, mm -hmm. but the, the greatest order is that it starts from the top, mm -hmm. coming down from God mm -hmm. to the parents. Mm -hmm. So everything is going back mm -hmm. to God. Mm -hmm. If people can be able to get the true light of God, mm -hmm. then I believe the best teacher. Mm -hmm. the, and you, when I call him teacher, I know from experience, mm -hmm. he doesn't take you in shortcuts. Mm -hmm. He will take you through the process. Mm -hmm. You may think he's so loving mm -hmm. that he will spare you the shortcuts. No, mm -hmm. he will take you through the process. Mm -hmm. So if people mm -hmm. can be able to turn back mm -hmm. to the one who make them, because what we are having now as a crisis, mm -hmm. to him is not a crisis. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He knows how to work it out. Mm -hmm. So if he can invest relationship in me as a mother, mm -hmm. as a father, mm -hmm. then what I have from him mm -hmm. being the right mm -hmm. structure mm -hmm. of growth relationship, mm -hmm. then that's exactly what I will pass. Mm -hmm. That's why he told the children of Israel, mm -hmm. make sure that these things that I'm telling you, mm -hmm. pass them to your children. Mm -hmm. So God is generational, mm -hmm. he is progressive, mm -hmm. he is transitional. Mm -hmm. There is no way he can love you so much mm -hmm. to take you from class one mm -hmm. and jump you all the way to class eight. Mm -hmm. Okay, he may do miraculously, mm -hmm. but the reality of life does not really respond mm -hmm. to magic and miracle. Mm -hmm. There is a structure of knowledge. God may give you a miracle, but if you go back to him mm -hmm. and look at why he brought the miracle, mm -hmm. there are things he structured you before. Mm -hmm. In, out of your knowing. Mm -hmm. So he is sure that if I place this miracle, mm -hmm. it is coming on hands mm -hmm. that are structured well. They, are ready. they can manage. They are ready. So this is something that viewers need to understand. Mm -hmm. And then we need to come into a reality mm -hmm. uh, in all dimensions of relationship because this one, I'm an ambassador of this. Mm -hmm. We can't live in blame. Mm -hmm. That's what Eve did. Mm -hmm. That's what Adam did. Mm -hmm. We can't live in blame. Mm -hmm. We have to come to a mature level mm -hmm. of looking at things and admitting, mm -hmm. yes, mm -hmm. we have failed. Mm -hmm. Can mothers, like I'm facing this camera, mm -hmm. face the situation and say, yes, mm -hmm. we have failed? Mm -hmm. Can children also look at it mm -hmm. and admit? Mm -hmm. Because the beginning of admission, mm -hmm. that's where the beginning of solution, mm -hmm. an atmosphere, mm -hmm. whereby people now can say, okay, what do we do? Yeah. We have failed, mom. Mm -hmm. I have failed because... It's on rare cases that you will find mothers who can call all their children and tell them, my children, mm -hmm. I know I may not have given you the best. Mm -hmm. I know I failed here. Mm -hmm. I failed. And listen to this. Mm -hmm. The fact that mama can say sorry mm -hmm. doesn't demean you mm -hmm. from your position. True. In fact, it strengthens your motherhood, mm -hmm. your father. Also to the fathers, mm -hmm. to the mothers, mm -hmm. to the pastors, mm -hmm. to the bishop, to the reverends. Mm -hmm. I believe it's the high time. Mm -hmm. Instead of saying who did, mm -hmm. who did, mm -hmm. can we all come into a, an atmosphere or a state of admission. Mm -hmm. Let's admit where have we failed. Mm -hmm. And if we have failed here, mm -hmm. how can we get a solution from this? Mm -hmm. If it is God, why can't we also humble, mm -hmm. turn to him? Mm -hmm. If it is men, why can't we humble, approach them mm -hmm. in the right honor? Mm -hmm. Then some of the things we are calling gaps, mm -hmm. they will start to diminish because mm -hmm. we can't deal with everything in prayer. Mm -hmm. There are things we will have to face in reality. Mm -hmm and say sorry, mm -hmm. swallow our pride, mm -hmm. and say I did wrong, wow. and I seek for forgiveness. Mm -hmm. wow. And men are willing to forgive, mm -hmm. so only that people are proud to receive. Mm -hmm. I <laughs> men are there. willing to receive, mm -hmm. but they are proud to? People, it's only that people are proud mm -hmm. to, say to say sorry. Men are willing to give out forgiveness, yes. but people are proud. And as we are thinking and we are talking about the month of love, yeah. the month of relationship. To me, I don't take it as a day. I, of course. I say it is of a lifelong mm -hmm. relationship. Mm -hmm. It's a journey. It's a long, uh, I mean, it starts all the way from if it is a family uh, relationship, yeah. from birth. From far. Like, and then in a songa. Mm -hmm. So I, I must say that uh, it's been a journey yeah, yeah, yeah. of concepts mm. upon concepts mm. a lot of facts 
lot of things that we need to reflect mm. and one thing that i usually know is that there is what we call the intra personal mm-hmm. yeah, relationship yeah, 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 yeah. that you mm-hmm. and that is what you have mentioned mm-hmm. about mm-hmm. and i want to thank you Very so key. much thank so you, much ma. for this mm. and for this uh, thank you too. what you have shared with mm. us and uh, just to add in one second just tell us what to do where they can get you mm. because you make us beautiful yeah, so yeah. tell us if also, one minute, daniel is a a uh, beauty a beautician mm-hmm. by profession mm-hmm. that's what i do for a long time mm-hmm. of course i do a lot but that's what i do currently mm-hmm. i also a sound technician mm-hmm. all that stuff an electrician mm-hmm. but i do beauty mostly mm-hmm. i'm based in thika mm-hmm. town mm-hmm. as well we are doing business mm-hmm. and also we are having a place in nairobi town mm-hmm. so daniel prince mm-hmm. if you find that name mm-hmm. you will see in brackets the nail doctor mm-hmm. so for the women mm-hmm. for the pastors wives mm-hmm. we beautify the nails i decided to major on nails okay. even though i know a lot mm-hmm. about beauty mm-hmm. but i do nails because of many reasons okay and so so our relationships <laughs> if somebody wants to get to you oh, uh, how can they contact you or they can get me facebook daniel prince yeah. maybe for inbox yes yeah. instagram the same yes yeah. uh my mobile the number that i use yes. 0738 yes. 93 yes. 96 yes. 93 yes. Uh, 0738 mm-hmm. 93 mm-hmm. 96 mm-hmm. uh, 93 yes. i know there are those who have my personal number yes mm-hmm. it's good to look beautiful mm-hmm. it's good to of course to love always yourself. and that love of yourself mm-hmm. it makes you also the greatest think about others and love other people. Yeah. And uh, I think that brings us to the close of this very exciting mm-hmm. episode. Yes, and uh, I would just request our viewers mm. just make a comment, tell us what you've taken away from this session. What have you learned from this relationship <laughs> session today mm. with Daniel? May I call him Kigen <laughs> because we have come from far. <laughs> Mm. and uh, i really believe that uh, we are learning something and it's learning. making an impact on your life even as we think a particular day let us think about our whole life mm. and it will make a difference mm. and until next time mm. follow us on all our social media platforms and i believe that we will learn something mm. and until next time god bless you mm. bye for now bye bye